John Murray and Brian Fortier face criminal charges in Belknap County Superior Court for allegedly sexually assaulting a teenage employee. They're also named in civil suits filed in federal court. The civil complaints allege that over a period of many years, the defendants used the West Alton Marina business to groom minors for sexual activity. That Murray, married to owner Brian Fortier, used the business to engage in sexual exploitation, including prostituting employees to customers that other owners knew and did nothing to stop it. And it alleges that this dramatically impacted lives, the case holding the business and its owners and employees accountable for the physical and emotional damage. Five former employees of the marina, four male and one female, claim they were subjected to sexual harassment, abuse, and groping. Today, attorneys representing the marina and its owners say publicity about the filings, including what they call unsubstantiated allegations and exaggeration, have caused great harm in the community to the marina and individual owners. They argued for dropping the John Doe pseudonyms for three of the alleged victims, saying they're now adults, not in involved in pending criminal charges, and that under case law, allegations make this more like workplace harassment cases that don't go forward under a DOE status. The attorney for those filing suit argues these victims of child sex abuse by people in positions of power should not lose their anonymity. Now, the judge also points to the potential chilling effect of naming alleged victims. She has requested, though, that they provide affidavits to the court as to why they want to remain anonymous and says that at least for now, during this pre-trial phase of the civil case, they will. Reporting live, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.